Well, hello, good evening. We are going to start our class pretty soon. Let's wait for everybody to come. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Hi. I was sad, teacher. Tell me why. I was sad. Tell me why. No, no. Pensé que no iba a declarar. Why not? <laughs> why not, my friend? There's always class. Just give me a second. My monitor is... It's acting okay. up. Perfect, teacher. Let's see, let's see. Just a minute, just a minute. Don't disconnect. Okay. Mr. Mauricio. Let's see, Hello, let's William. see now. Okay, okay, okay. So tell me, William, how was your day? Uh, fantastic, that's great. Uh, I am uh, big in the vacation, teacher. Oh, really? You're on vacation? Yes. That's today. Cool. I know. That's excellent to be on vacation in school. And what are your what are your regular activities when you are on vacation? Tell me. What what time are you waking up? Uh, always uh, five five a.m. teacher. Are you on vacation? Yes. Yeah. And at five. No puedo, ¿cómo se dice? I cannot. I cannot sleep. Oh my gosh. Man, whenever uh -huh. I get vacation, the first day I wake up around 10. Is possible. Eh, este, <clears throat> me despierto, ¿cómo se diría? I wake up. Is possible I wake up. Este, antes de la hora, antes de... Before five the hours, before hours, uh, yes. Thank you, teacher. Oh, that's terrible. I mean, it's good when you are working, but when you are on vacation, it's not good. Uh, yes, well, teacher. anyway, and at what time do you go to sleep? What? What time do you go to sleep? Uh, 11 p.m. teacher. Oh, that's early. Just yes. No, no yeah, that's early, that's early. I usually go to sleep around 12.30, 1 a.m. No, 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 no. In occasion, is the after the class. You go straight to sleep. Yes. That's cool. That's nice. That's nice. Well, welcome to the class, William. It's nice to have you here. Thank you. Yeah. You're welcome, teacher. Walter. Hello, Walter. How are you? Uh, hello, teacher. Good evening. Uh, Good evening. Five, how are you? I'm fine. Fine. Sure. Tell yes. me, how was your day? Well, I'm very relaxed and my work at the moment. Uh, um, relaxing. Okay. A relaxed day. Yes. That's a relaxed cool. day, yes. Excellent, excellent. And tell me, what time do you wake up, Walter? What time do you wake? Do, do you, you wake, do you wake up? Despierta. Okay. Uh, I went at uh, 
and six and excuse me five five o'clock at five o'clock uh, uh, and usually on five o'clock okay that's cool yes and at what time do you go to work because you live very close what time do you go to work oh um and I want to go in six and forty-five. Six forty-five. Oh my gosh, <laughs> man! I will wake up at six six twenty somewhere around that. Yo me despertaría oh. solo seis seis veinte. Oh, and the party and the drink pads uh, and my wife and the uh, and drink pads. Breakfast. Yes. Okay. Oh, you have breakfast before going to sleep, going to work. And no, no, you're in my house. That's why before yes. antes de. You have breakfast before going to work. Yes, before at, uh, okay. after work. Okay. Yes. Okay. Uh, do you remember? And I remember and yesterday and. Remember and um, uh, what is your uh, food favorite restaurant? Favorite restaurant. Favorite restaurant. And my and my favorite people. Uh, I love in ceviche. Too. How do you say? Oh, really? Shrimp. How do you say? You say it? Shrimp. Oh, Shrimp. Shrimp. Oh, shrimp and delicious. And shrimp. And, uh, and ceviche. Uh, alajillo, guisado. Oh, really? Uh, 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 no importa. <laughs> it doesn't me. matter. It doesn't matter. You say no, it, I, para decir no importa, you say it like this. Look, you say. It. It. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. It doesn't matter. Oh, thank you. It doesn't matter. 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 It doesn't matter. matter. It doesn't matter, teacher. I love it. Okay. Uh, you just love ceviches. Excuse me, teacher. Do you, you just love ceviches? Simplemente le encanta. Oh, oh. Se me está cortando el internet, teacher. Simplemente, ¿qué me dijo? Le encantan. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh. His favorite food. Favorite, favorite. Excuse me, favorite. Okay, excellent. Well, thank you very much, Walter, and welcome to the class. Welcome to you. Let's see, let's see. Marta, hello, how are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? I'm good, teacher. And you? Well, here, you know. Same old story. Same life. Same. Yeah, you know, working, working, working. That's the way it is. Yes, I know. <laughs> what about you? Tell me, we're talking about schedules today. So tell me, what's your schedule? What time do you wake up, Marta? Uh, I depend. In, in this weekend, I... I oh, yeah, you're, on, you're on vacation, me. yes. Yes. Okay, what so, time are you waking up now that you're on vacation? I Normally, I wake, wake up uh, 8 a.m. Okay. Or I usually, morning. I usually <laughs> wake up. Okay. You, I usually, you usually wake up. Yes, I, I usually wake usually, up. I usually wake up. 
or later or or later yes later 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 okay that's cool that's cool and around what time are you having breakfast um normally uh or usually uh my breakfast i take uh 10 10 p.m 10 a.m hmm, a little bit late yes it's, well, it's because um, i wake up so late that's cool. <laughs> Okay, but when you go to work, at what time do you wake up? Wake up at uh, 7 a.m. because I homework. Oh, you're working from home? Yes. I That's check cool. in at 8.30. 8.15 or 8.50? 8.50. Really? That's yes. cool. So you take it easy. Yes, it's it's good it's schedule for me. Okay, what time do you finish working? Uh, no, no check out my in my work. Uh, no check out normal, hour? No, no check out hour because oh, sometimes uh, we we work more late later until late later until or you late. can say until until um, late until until late but my schedule for default is uh, 5 30 p.m check okay. out okay mm -hmm. okay 5 50 that's okay I mean, yes. it's not eight. It's not no, ten. no. Okay, what time do you but usually sometimes, have dinner? Yes, uh, dinner uh, normally uh, 6 p.m. A what? Yes. Dinner at 6 p.m.? Yes, early. You know, oh the calories <laughs> more late is not good for me. Come on, Marta. I have I have dinner. I take my dinner around 10 30 p.m. 11 after the no, class. No, it's it's more it's more late for the calories in the body. <laughs> well, you know, I don't really like pay attention to that that much. Well, thank you very much, Marta. Nice having you here in class. You're welcome, teacher. Let's see. Uh, where's Amber? I remember I saw Amber here somewhere around. No, she disconnect. Amber, hello. Yes. I remember Sorry. I saw you. Hello, Amber, how are you? I'm fine. What about you? Well, here you know. Same old, same old. Same old story every day. Tell me, Ambar, we are talking about schedules. What time do you wake up? Do you usually wake up? Uh, in my case, I, I usually wake up at say uh, 5, 5 a.m. And I, then I, I have breakfast um, 6, 6 a.m. and my job my yes. schedule is 7 a.m to 4 p.m okay what time do you have breakfast you told me uh, 6 a.m 6 a.m breakfast at 6 a.m yes man i would die with that schedule i cannot <laughs> eat before eight yes uh, before uh, in my how do you say my antiguo trabajo in my previous job in my previous job my schedule uh, was uh, 6 a.m and i i have breakfast 
5 a.m. At 5 a.m. Wow. Breakfast at 5. No, man, that's not. Before possible, uh, my job it, it was in the company, right? Is in my house. Yeah, but I mean, I cannot. I mean, for me, it's not possible to have breakfast that early. It's a, it's a big no-no for me. I mean, I just it's, simple cannot. It's my routine. I, I think that is uh, how do you say? Ya estoy acostumbrado. I am used to it. I am used to it. I am used to it. Yeah, because I mean, oh, for me that will be crazy. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I just, I wouldn't. So, what time do you have dinner, Amber? Um, I usually I have dinner seven eight p.m. But today I not have dinner. No, I uh, didn't. I didn't have dinner, but right now I will have dinner. Okay, because well, why not? Because uh, I um I no sé cómo se dice pedir pupusas por delivery. Oh really? I order I order pupusas uh, for delivery, but uh, it. <laughs> bueno, acaban de llegar. The, oh, they just arrived. They, they just arrived. Just. Oops. I'm sorry that my fingers are not helping me. They just arrived. Well, yes. thank you very much, Amber. Nice having you here in class today. Yes, thank you, teacher. Okay, I remember I have Francisco Jose around. Hello, Francisco, how are you? Hi, teacher, how are you? I'm well, and you? I'm sorry? I'm fine, and you? Well, you know, you know. Here, same old story. Another day, another dollar. <laughs> yeah, another day, another dollar, my friend. Okay, teacher. Well, uh, these two days for me was very hard because I'm somehow in the in the company. We have so many problems with the information, and they make. Uh, I don't know what to say, but uh, speciality rewards. <laughs> and oh, really? Special they, rewards? Yeah. Rewards, yeah. And what do you mean? Like bonus? Me, yeah. I like, I, I mean, no. but today, but well, yesterday, have a meeting in the afternoon and then in the, in the night. At and night. my chief say, at night. At night, my chief say, well, uh, if you want to win the bonus, you will to connect <laughs> and they'll try to. Uh, yesterday I finished at 11.30. Yeah, almost 11.30. It That's was crazy. very, very hard. Yeah, but today imagine. was my day off. But still you were tired. Yeah. It's very tired, but how many hours did you work yesterday? I think so. Was uh 12 or 13 hours? Yeah, that was a lot of time. Yeah, a lot in a lot of calls. <laughs> I can imagine, I can imagine. Well, the good thing is that you're here now. Tell me what time yeah. do you usually wake up, Francisco? For my chief is very, I think so was very, very in the afternoon, no, the afternoon, sorry, very fast morning. 
Uh, usually 9 p.m. No, pardon, sorry, 9 a.m. 9.30 a.m. Almost. My chief is start at 10 a.m. Okay. Yeah. yeah, that's cool. That's cool. So what time do you have breakfast? At 9 a.m. I'll start when I wake up. <laughs> My okay. wife is prepared and just oh. only only burning. I don't know. Only calentarlo. Warm up. Warm up. Yeah. So that's not a problem for you. Breakfast. Yeah. You just open your eyes and breakfast is ready. Yeah. That's cool. That's actually cool. It's very, very cool for me. I can imagine. I can imagine. Excellent. Excellent. So tell me, what time do you go to sleep? What time do you usually go to sleep? Um, yesterday I sleep very, very... I went to sleep. No. <laughs> I went to sleep very long, but it's fast. Very late. To... Very late. Yeah. Very late. It's fast to, to 1 a.m. But usually, I mean, what's uh, what's uh, your usually? Normal? Usually, yeah. it's almost eleven p.m. At eleven p.m. Okay, that's well because sometimes I I really want to play some hours, but I can do it a lot of time for for my my song is want to need to take to sleep or to left to the kinder and oh really how that. old how old is your son it's four years oh. almost five years in november oh so he's in preschool yeah in preschool 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 you see yeah preschool in preschool Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Excellent. Excellent. So tell me, what time is your your lunch break? It's the best because trouble is in the company have a schedule for schedule the, a schedule for the time for the for the job and sometimes. I, w I, went, I went to 1 p.m. Sometimes I, I went to the... I go, I go. Go I in go, present, sorry. went in past. Yeah, I go to the 1 p.m. And sometimes I go to the 1.30 p.m. Okay. It's usually no, no, I'm like... sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Let's see. We are talking about the launch schedule. So... Instead of saying I go, we'll say I take it. I take it. I take it. Yeah. I take it at 1 p.m. and sometimes I take it at 1.30. 1 30. Yeah. Okay, that's quite interesting. Welcome to the class, Francisco. Thank you. Thank you, DJ. I'm so glad to see her. Okay, guys. Before we move on, let's let me get the uh, uh, uh. let me get the attendance please very please let's see just give me a second so i can get it ready here on my list today is thursday the 15th amber eli alfaro present teacher perfect and Carlos Antonio Murillo Hernandez. Here. Claudia Lizet Ramos Barrientos. Present. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Present teacher. Thank you, Daniel. Edora de Mir Noyola Brito. Elvia Janet Beltrán de Cabrera. Present teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. El bíblico nadie va a explotar por guardar un secreto. Creo que está por el eclipse de la Biblia. Just 
Give me a second, guys. It's better if I do it like this. Okay. Jose Ernesto Osorio Moran. I'm present teacher. Thank you. Hey, Jose, you fix your problem. That's cool. Yes, I, I already bought uh, a new pair of headphones and I will That's be cool. able mm -hmm. to participate. That's great. To That's partici great. Participate in class. That's excellent. Thank you. Maria Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. Maria Luisa Morales de Corpeño. Present teacher. Thank you, Maria Luisa. Your meeting finished? No, aún todavía no. Creo que en unos cinco minutos finish. Oh, cool, cool. I'll take it okay. into an account. Lo tomar en cuenta. Don't worry. Marta Navelinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Thank you, Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present teacher. Roxana Iveta Asensio de Mejía. Present teacher. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Yeah. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present. Thank you. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Janira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present teacher. Francisco José Menéndez Aguilar. Present teacher. Linda Marlene Acosta Barrera. Okie dokie. Let's see. Okay. Well, let's continue. Roxana, where are you, Roxana? Hi, I'm here. Good evening. Hello. Hello, Rosana. Good evening. How are you today? I'm fine. It was a very busy day. Oh, really? How are you? Yes. Okay, Roxana. We are asking about schedules. Tell me, what time do you usually wake up, Roxana? I usually wake up around 6.45, I guess. Okay. My work starts at 7 a.m. from 7 a.m. So I just have 15 minutes to finish to wake up. Okay, to finish waking and, up. Yeah, <laughs> I have five more minutes in bed. Okay. And then I take my breakfast around 9 a.m. Okay. Because I just take uh, some uh, slice of uh, bread or mm -hmm. coffee and cookies or something like that. Okay, something light. I go muy liviano. Yeah. Yeah. And my lunch, I I don't have I don't have time I don't have a specific time to take my lunch because it depends about my my uh, job. But I usually take my lunch around one p.m. Okay. or one or two p.m. maybe. And I finish my work at uh, sometimes 4 p.m. But I usually finish it maybe in 5.30 p.m., 6 p.m. And I take my dinner, uh, um, I don't know, maybe usually at 6.30 p.m. or 7 p.m. Oh my. Gosh, that's pretty my, early for me. Yeah, no, why, teacher? I, my best friend told me that she takes uh, the her dinner at nine or ten p.m. For me, it's too late. 
No, that's acceptable for me. 9, 10 p.m., it's okay. I take it around 10, 30, 11. I don't have age for this disorder. <laughs> How old are you, my dear? You're young. You're younger Fearing than me. Fearing one. Fearing yeah, one. you're a little kid. <laughs> but I don't know. Yeah. In my case, my father always tried to take the dinner too early. Sometimes 5 30 p.m. or 6 p.m. So I have you got a, used to it. Yeah, I have I just do it. Yeah. Man, I, I mean I wouldn't I wouldn't be able to do that. For me, that's no. not acceptable. <laughs> I cannot. Well, thank you, Roxana, and welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. Okay, okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Who else is around? Who else is around? Where's uh, mm -hmm. Susana? Where's Susana? Susana, where are you? Be here. I'm here. Okay, Susana, tell me about your schedule, please. Um, is they is today um i schedule in my work at uh, 7 a.m okay you start um, at 7 a.m I, I start at 7 a.m uh finish it um and six six thirty p.m oh, that's a long day that's a long day Yes. <laughs> How much time it's do you a, have for lunch? A, uh, my lunch in I have a lunch uh, at one p.m. Uh, only uh, thir thirty minutes. Thirty minutes. Thirty minutes. Yes. Okay, well, that's a heavy day. So you finish working <laughs> very late. What time do you usually have dinner? Um, I have dinner. Mm, I finish the class, teacher. Thank when you finish the class. <laughs> yeah, just like me. That's, <laughs> that's, that's yes. normal for me. Okay, welcome, Susanna, and thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Okay, let's see Shanira. Where are you, Shanira? Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Tell us about your schedule, Shanira. Okay. I usually wake up at 7 a.m. And I take breakfast at 7.30. After okay. that, after that, I usually take a lunch at 12. Finally, I usually take a dinner, take dinner at 7.30 p.m. and go to bed around 2.11. Go to bed around 11 p.m.? Yeah, because before the class, I make the, the homework in platform. Oh, that's good. Cool. Then I see a little time TV and I go watch. To I watch. I watch. I watch. I watch. I watch TV. I watch or TV. Uh, a little bit. You can say a little bit. Okay, a little bit. Oh, that's cool. That's cool, man. I mean, if I start watching TV when I get to bed. Oh, I could go to sleep around 2 a.m. or 3 uh, sometimes. I program my TV because always I, I You sleep. fall asleep. Yeah. I fall asleep. I fall asleep, yes. That's cool. No, I mean, if I start reading or watching TV, man, I don't sleep. This happened with... Uh, uh, at the last series, 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 how do you say? Yeah, series. Series that I saw uh, early day. 
because was interested and I can't stop. <laughs> oh, that means that, uh, hold on. That means that you got hooked. You get hooked on that series. Saying that. Atrapado. Uh, yeah. 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 Th this series hook hook me. Okay, that's cool. Well, thank you very much. Thank you, and teacher. Welcome. Thank you. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Claudia. Hello. Hello, teacher. What about you, Claudia? Tell me a little bit about your schedule. Um when I get up at 5 a.m. I usually get up at 5 a.m. Oh, 5 a.m., man. But now I I get up at 7 a.m. because I I work in my 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 house. Okay, I work from home. From home, okay. I work from home. Um I I came at class from 7:30 a.m. at 10 a.m. After 7 that, I went to social. I to. Oh, you are talking I, about today. Está hablando acerca de ahora. Yes, I went to social. Social security. Okay. I went to this because I feel bad. The doctor I felt, said, I, I felt, felt. Okay, I felt bad. The doctor say I have laryngitis. Oh, yeah, that's normal in us teachers. Eso es normal en nosotros. Yes. Yeah, that, yes. that happens a lot to teachers. I mean, we get infections on the throat quite regularly, muy regularmente. Yes. I, that's normal. After vacations, it always happens to me. Cada vez que tenemos vacaciones me pasa. That I get an infection and sometimes I get a three or four days leave. Yes, teacher. A mí también me, me pasa. Ah. Is correct say I got home at, at six p.m. Yeah, I got home at 6 p.m. And I sent an exam for review by my boss. And after that, I sleep. Oh, really? You slept? You took a nap? I took a nap. Tome una siesta. Ah, okay, I took a nap. That's I, cool. Yes, yes, I, I wake up I mean, at 8 I wish I, I wish I could take naps. Yo desiera tomar, uh, desiera por tomar siestas. You know, if I take a nap, I wake up feeling, uh, feeling like hangover, you know? Si yo me tomo una siesta, cuando despierto me siento like, like if I were hangover, como que estuviera hangover. You know, I get a headache, I feel terrible, and I feel like my eyes burn, even my stomach feels bad. So for me, taking naps is not possible. Okay. Do you know the word hangover? ¿Conoce la palabra hangover? No. It's like saying, como decir, crudo. Ah, like okay. uh, when somebody drinks alcohol. Si yo me tomo una siesta, cuando me despierto, me siento así. Terrible. Okay. So for me, it's not like acceptable. Well, thank you, Claudia, and welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. Let's see, Fernando. Hello, Fernando. Hello, teacher. How are you? Fine. <laughs> Fine. I have a problem with, with the connection. So, okay. Tell me about your schedule. We are talking about schedule today. 
my schedule. Um, now, because I work from home, I usually get up at 6.30 or okay. 7. Get up or wake up. Remember, we are talking about two different things. Recuérdense que hablamos dos, dos cosas distintas. Wake up is the moment when you open your eyes. Get up is when you get up from bed. Okay, uh, I woke up. Okay, I wake up. Okay, I wake up uh, usually upstairs or even 7 a.m. because I work from home. <laughs> okay, what time do you have your breakfast? Um, around 8 a.m. I, I drink some coffee and okay. around 10 a.m. I, I take a refrigerator. A snack. A snack. I take a snack or I have a, a little snack. I have a little snack. Yeah. Un yeah, around 10, 10 a.m. Oh, that's then, cool. Yeah, and uh, my, I have a lunch, I have lunch. Okay, yeah, I have, I have I lunch have, or I take lunch, whichever. I have, okay, I have lunch at 1 p.m. At 1 uh, p.m.? 1 p.m., yeah, my, my schedule, uh, Establece. Establishes. Uh, my schedule establishes that the lunch uh, tiene que durar. Must last. Must last. Yeah. Must okay. last. Let me text it to you. Okay. Thank you. Must last. Debe durar. Must last. Ah, okay. My schedule establishes mm -hmm. that the lunch must last one hour. And one hour for lunch? Okay. One hour for lunch. And uh, the employees, uh, they have the lunch between, between 12, 12 p.m. and 2 p.m. Okay, no, not 12 p.m., 12 at noon. 12 at say, noon. Yeah, 12 at noon. That's what I really. Oh, really? That's oh, okay. cool. Yeah. That's then cool. I then I take I take the lunch at 1 p.m. and I come back to the work at 2 p.m. Oh really? Yes. That's nice. Uh, do you have a do you have a break time in the afternoon? Uh no. No, I work all, all long. So there's there's no coffee time. Uh, yeah, so, según, según el horario. According to schedule? Okay. According to schedule, I have no, no break time. But, but, uh, I have. okay. <laughs> okay, that's, that's cool, that's cool. Yeah. Well, thank you, Fernando, <clears throat> very interesting. Thank you, teacher. Okay, now, Francisco. Francisco Eduardo. Hello, mister. Hello, teacher. Well, you got a pretty crazy schedule, Francisco. <laughs> sometimes you work at night, sometimes you work during the day. So tell uh, me, what's, how's usually your schedule? I would like to understand it. Uh, well, uh, in my work, I have uh, three shifts. Uh, uh, once uh, I uh, I start at six a.m. <clears throat> and uh, I go up at two p.m. in in this in this schedule schedule uh, schedule, I, schedule uh, I get up at uh, 4 a.m. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, and I take a, a, how do you say, transport t-shirt? Transport, transportation? Transport. Mm -hmm. Okay, and but I, you're talking about company transportation. 
Yes, company transportation. Okay. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Okay, uh, I I take a uh, company transportation at 5 a.m. I what? 5 a.m. Oh my five. gosh, that's mm -hmm. terrible. <laughs> uh, it's a uh, one hour to. Oh, okay. Listen, listen. It's mm -hmm. one hour trip. It's a one yes. hour trip. Yes, I. Uh, it's a one. Uh, usually, uh, usually it's a one hour in wow. company transportation in, in bus. Uh, Usually it's a uh, one one. How do you say one hour and media, teacher? One hour, hour and half. a half. Uh, okay, uh, one hour a half. Uh, oh, uh, from kilo cinco to Achadura. To the, uh, my case, the border. To the border. Uh, yes, to the border. Um, but uh, I got my home uh, uh, from my home to Kilo Cinco, approxim approximately uh, is a uh, mm, 20, 20 minutes, 20 minutes, uh, a half hour. Okay, where do you live, Sonsonate? In, in Acajutla. Okay, yeah. I mean, it's close, it's pretty close. Yes, uh, only the, 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 the transport uh, is not regular. Uh, oh yeah, at that time even less, menos a esa hora. Yes, so, uh, only uh, I is, I using the public transport uh, when public. I... Public. public. Public transport when I... Uh, I have a uh, afternoon shift when I I start my shift uh, at 2 p.m. Okay. Only, and what, only, what about when you got the, the morning shift? Uh, uh, excuse me, teacher. Repeat me, please. Okay. You use public transportation from your house to Kilo Cinco. Yes, uh, only uh, when you have the, the afternoon shift. What about when yes. you get the morning shift? In the morning shift, uh, when I go out my my work, uh, uh, I use the trust the public transportation. Okay, well, interesting, very interesting. Yeah, as I said, your schedule is kind of weird. <laughs> in, in the in the night shift, uh, I in this case uh, I have a, a or or I use the company transportation when I entry and when I go out. Oh, that's cool. Mm -hmm. That's cool. You save money. Te ahorra. Sí. That's always good. <laughs> Yeah, cool. Thank you very much, Francisco. Excellent. And welcome to the class. No, thanks to you. Now, let's see, let's see, let's see who hasn't talked to me. Uh, let's see, Wilfredo, what about you? You are too serious today, Wilfredo. Come on, man. Tell me about yourself. Wilfredo, can you hear me? Thank you, Joe. Hello, my friend. Tell me, what about your schedule? Um, was busy. Okay, was busy, tell, me, tell me, how's your regular schedule? Como es un día normal for you? Well, I wake up at, at at 5, 5 a.m. and then um, and at 5 and 30, I go to my work, my work. Okay. And I start in my job at 
seven, around seven a.m. every day. And I, I finished from Monday to Tuesday at 4 and 30 p.m. And Friday, I start to 7 a.m. too, and I finish 3 and 30 p.m. And in my workplace, um, there usually, it is usual that have the same, the same trouble, uh, COVID attendant. If okay, what, what time do you go to sleep with, Fredo? Um, I go to sleep at 11 and 30 or 12 p.m. every day. Okay, that's early, that's early. So you're having dinner before class? Right? No, no. When I arrive at home, I have dinner around six. That's why before antes de. I'm okay. Before classes, teacher, around and six. If I if I eat around six, around eleven or twelve, <clears throat> I will be biting everything, the table or. I don't know, whatever. Si yo como a esa hora, como a las 11 de la noche, estoy mordiendo la mesa, la silla, uh, everything that is on my path. Uh, yeah, um, I will teacher, be, look at but, this word. I will be revenues. Yes, teacher. Me. Revenues. Yes, tell me. Um, but uh, I want, I'm sorry. Um, I, I I want to tell you that I Oops, you froze Wilfredo. Yeah, but only but when I was a child only drink coffee in the morning. But yeah, I, I can just have a cup of coffee in the morning too. No, but, but I hardly ever take breakfast, but I don't know. I, how do you say, la costumbre? The habit. The habit, oh, this is my, my habit. Um, hardly ever, teacher, I, 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 I can breakfast. Because if I have- I can have. I can have breakfast. I can have breakfast. Okay, but, look, look, recordemos las reglas, okay? I. Hardly ever can have breakfast. Hardly ever I can have breakfast. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Hardly Regan ever. Dice, primero el sujeto. Uh, I, I have, okay. I, I hardly, hardly ever, ever can have breakfast. Can have breakfast. Perfect. Well, oh, okay. thank you very much, Wilfredo. Excellent. Okay, thank teacher. You. Welcome. Now, Jose, tell me about your schedule, Jose. Ready. <laughs> uh, good evening. Good evening. Uh, MSK should start uh, around 5 oh, 5 a.m. because I always get up at, at this hour and take a, take a shower around 5 10 a.m. <laughs> Uh, and I get dressed and I always get, get dressed at 5.35 a.m. Okay, very early in the morning. Yes, okay. and I usually drive to work at 5.40 and get to work around... 6 5, 15 a.m. because I it takes me a while a while to get there because I drive a minibus and bring oh. some people uh -huh, and bring some people to, to my work. Oh really and, yeah well, and no, I, I, not I, bring I take I take I take okay and I take some people oh that's nice so you got a route 
Uh, yes. And That's I earn cool. extra money for that. Excellent. Whenever there's extra money, man, that's cool. Yes. It's a big responsibility. <laughs> yeah, also. It's a big also it's a yes. responsibility because everybody's there waiting for you. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, and if and... it doesn't appear, everybody's like, ah, oh, where is him? <laughs> yes. In this, in this, in this week, <laughs> me pasó. It happened to me this week. Ah, it happened to me this week. I, I, oh. I wake, wake up. I woke up. I wake up uh, late. <laughs> some Ooh. minutes, some minutes, and and I, uh, when I get up, uh, it's scary. Yeah, that's crazy, man. That's crazy. Yeah, you yes. know, it, it happened to me with some friends of mine. Nos pasaba unos amigos that we used to ride together. Nos íbamos juntos. There were like, there were like five, five of us who were riding. So we used to take different cars every day. One day my car, one day my friend's car, the next day the other friend's car. And we all used to pitch in, pitch in for gas. Uh -huh. But whenever there was a problem with a car, it was crazy. It was really yes. crazy. Particularly yes. because because my friends they used to work at, at call centers, so no. they were like they were like crazy for their bonuses. Okay, yeah, I, I, I get it. And yes, it, it's a, a good a good option to to save some some fuel. Some box, yeah. Oh, yeah. Some box. Excellent, yes. excellent. Thank you very much, Jose. Okay. Welcome. Thanks. Thanks to you. Okay. Let's see who's missing. Who's missing? Uh, I'm sorry. I'm going to make a pause here. Va a ser una pequeña pausa. Yo sé que algunos, particularmente los que me participaron al inicio, están como, ah, ¿y a qué horas comienza esto? No. Esto que estamos haciendo es parte de la clase. And I need to do it with everyone. Y necesito hacerlo con todos. Okay. It's very, very important. You will see why. Vamos a ver por qué en unos momentos. But I just want to make sure all of you understand that this is, actually, this is part of the class. Hoy no comencé con el, tanto con el saludo y, y qué tal y cómo estamos, sino que directamente con la actividad because it's long. And as I told you before, this is basic six. You are going to pre-intermediate, so I need you speaking. Lo necesito hablando, okay? So let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Where is who's next? Yes. Teacher. Hi, Luisa. Hello. Yes, I can hear you. Sorry, teacher. Uh, the meeting finished very, very late. Late, late. Late, uh-huh. Su okay, Supported, don't... supported, uh, finished, was, no, finished the uh, 8 p.m. Uh, yeah, however, happens. don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, Maria Lisa. Okay, okay. The good thing is that you're here. Tell me, Maria Lisa, what time do you wake up? I I I I get up get up six six uh, a.m. Six a.m. Okay. Yes, continue, please. Then then take a shower. The they take a shower six 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 thirty or okay. six six half six thirty it's okay uh -huh. then put my my clothes Clo clothes okay then uh -huh. I get dressed I get uh -huh. dressed I get my dress uh huh um so uh I have have my my coffee. Okay. Then, my cup of coffee. My then cup of coffee. I my cup of coffee. Uh huh. Then I go in. I I when. I go. I when my going. 
Okay. Oops, I'm losing you, Maria. Work. Uh, I go. I go my work. Okay. Uh -huh. the, then start my work. Is uh, start a a e n. Then okay, going going a, a meeting a a Santana. Okay, at then, Santana. At Santana uh, at the meeting with my clients, and and then rest rest. Regresé. I came Start back. Oh, I came back. Uh -huh. uh, at 2 p.m. 2 p.m. Then, then the uh, other other meeting. Uh, fin finish uh, five five p.m. Uh, then. Other meeting the six to pm. Eh, the then um, other class the a a a pm the English. Okay. So you have had a very yeah. long day. Ha tenido un día largo. Yeah, very. Okay, well, please. thank you very much, Maria. Excellent. Thank well you. Thank you. Now, Maria Alejandra, I see that you are like hiding. I got you. And where's Nicolas? Nicolas was around here. The left. Hi, teacher. Hello. What do you mean? <laughs> Tell me about your schedule, please. Teacher, I am a lazy person. <laughs> okay. I get up at eight, at a fifteen or fifteen minutes at night at night because I start my work at nine I am. <laughs> Okay, well, that's normal, that's normal, don't worry. Continue, and, please. Um, I take, uh, I usually take my breakfast at 10 a.m. Okay. And, and I have, I take a shower at, uh, in my hour, in my lunch hour. Okay. <laughs> and I prepare, I usually prepare my lunch because I eat lunch. <laughs> okay. And, and I finish my work at 7 p.m. Oh, straight. Because I work nine hours plus okay. my hour lunch. My lunch hour. My lunch hour, and in the day I work ten hours, maybe. <laughs> around, around ten around hours. Around ten hours, and I take the dinner. I usually take the dinner uh, before the class, but when I don't have a lot of time, or when I don't realize my homework, or no is any tarea. <laughs> okay, when I don't do, when I haven't done, when, when I, I haven't done. When I haven't done my homework, I still, before, uh, before that class, before that class. And, oh, gosh. And take my dinner at 9 a.m. when my sister cook. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yes. And I still sleep to um, 12, at 12, 12, uh -huh. and then we pass. <laughs> okay, we go to sleep at 12, 
but you sleep until late. Mm, but I sleep uh, very, a lot of hours than these hours. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Perfect, thank you very much. Now I need to hear Elvia and then Sylvia. Hey, I'm missing Daniel also. Elvia, your turn. Hello, teacher. I get up at 5.30 a.m. Then okay. I take a shower, get dressed, um, prepare breakfast, um six um if 15 okay. a.m and um, i brush my skin i, I brush. brush my skin and must be must be ready at um a quarter to seven a.m to go to the office. Okay. I ar arrive at the office at 8 a.m. Uh, start work. And I'll, I take I take lunch at 1 p.m. I leave work at 5 p.m. Okay. I I get to the prepare dinner at um, seven p.m. Uh, I usually sleeping at eleven p.m. Okay, you got to sleep very early at eleven. That's early. <laughs> Thank you, Elvia. Let's see, where's Daniel? Daniel, your turn, please. Daniel, hello. Well, let's see, Sylvia, your turn. Hello, teacher. Tell us about your schedule. Um, my schedule every day, I get up uh, seven or eight in the morning. I took a shower when my, when my shift is at seven i have to get up at 6 a.m then i have to take a bath uh, make my breakfast make my breakfast first uh, eat breakfast and then go to work or when i when my my shift is at 1 p.m i get up late i get up at 8 or 9 a.m a.m. Um, I prepared my breakfast, then my lunch. I always do the laundry. I always okay, do my laundry. Cool. I prepare lunch. I get dressed and I go to work. And I finish at 8 p.m. So when I finish at 8, sometimes I eat pupusas. When I uh, when I finish my schedule, sometimes at 8 p.m. I go to the pupuseria, or sometimes I I came to my house I and I eat here. I come to my to my house and I eat uh, dinner here, and then I took my English class. Okay, yeah, that's, that's my cool. that's so my schedule. Yes. What time do you usually go to sleep? Uh. 
when I have classes at 11. When you get classes at 11, when you don't? Yes. Uh, 10. 10, 9.30 or, or 10 p.m. But I feel really tired when I go to sleep at 11. Because sometimes I, I go to sleep at 11 and then I get up at, at 5.30 in the morning uh, because I have to, to prepare my breakfast and take a bath, get dressed, and then go to work because sometimes I start working at 7. You start working at 7? Sometimes I start working at 7 or sometimes at 1 p.m. Okay, yes. perfect. Perfect, perfect. Just let me check on something, please. Thank you very much. Okay, please. thank you. Okay, guys, thank you very much. Thanks for your patience. Let's see, I need to get attendance again. I'm sorry. Just let me get rid of this again. Now, let's see, Amber Eliel Faro Gomez. Amber, you said present? Yeah. Present. Thank you. Carlos Antonio Murillo Hernandez. Here. Claudia Lisette Ramos Barrientos. Present. Daniel Eduardo Seguedo Valencia. Present teacher. Eduardo Ademir Noyola Brito. Elvia Chanet, Beltrán de Cabrera. Present teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barritos Romero. Present teacher. María Luisa Morales de Corpeño. Present teacher. Marta Anabelinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Roxana Iveta Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Avendaño Pineda. Present teacher. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Chanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present teacher. Francisco José Menéndez Aguilar. Present teacher. Linda Marlene Acosta Barrera. Okay, thank you very Teacher, I'm much. Here. Yes, thank you, Edward. Don't worry, don't worry. I already get you in the attendance. No problem. Okay, guys, now let's see. Today, as a, well, as you have realized, we are talking about schedules, okay? The day, a regular day for you, a regular day for somebody in your company, or perhaps in your particular situation. Now, we are going to go right now to the part of the conversation because there is a conversation. 
we're going to be working today in page number 23 on your manuals, okay? Página 23 del manual. We got a conversation there for you to check it out. Tenemos una conversación por ahí. And the conversation goes like this. Let me share it with you. Okay. The conversation says, Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know? You're right. Look, who has the early and late chief for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kate have the evening shift. I repeat. Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know? You're right. Look, who has the early and late shift for this coming weekend. According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kate have the evening shift. Okie dokie. Now I will repeat a third time. Just hold on that I made a little mistake. Oh. Teacher, sorry, I got yes, a question. Mr. Yes. Okay, and I have the, I think so, have two forms to say chief, but I don't remember who is the other. What do you mean? Another way to say? I mean, chief, chief is like uh, the hour of your work. But I other way to say chief, but I can't remember. Another way to say chief. Mm. I mean, let's see. Another way to say chief. Let's see what could it be. Uh, working day. I mean, you got specific. No, I guess, I guess, day. I guess, yeah, it's working day is the same of chief. But I remember when I stay uh, so many, so many years ago in the classroom, say the teacher, ah, the other way to say chief is like that. But I can't remember. Yeah, me neither, because I mean, I am acquainted with uh, Chief Working Day. But let's see. Estamos hablando, cuando decimos Working Day, estamos diciendo específicamente jornada. El día de trabajo. Jornada. No, working Day means jornada. La jornada, sí. That's specific translation. I'm sorry, Francisco. There's... I'm sorry, I will mute you for a second because there's a lot of noise in your house. Okay, so when we say working day, that means exactly jornada. And shift, uh, actually shift, it's a little bit more like um, turno, como decir turno. But uh, I don't know another one. Yes, Francisco Eduardo? Uh, I have a, a other question. In, in my work, uh, usually I, I, I use the, how do you say, hora militar teacher? Yeah, 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 uh, the, the, the military time. Military or uh, In English, uh, how do you say that this, uh, 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 for example, uh, uh, usually, uh, when I I start my chief at uh, 2 p.m. Um, you start say, your chief at the 14 hours. No, 14,000 actually. 14, no, the yes, 14, 14 hours. 14, right? Mm -hmm. uh, 
is uh, is it the the correct say 14 yeah. hours okay. yeah you can say that that's correct okay francisco well i don't remember another one francisco but i will look it up okay Voy a preguntar. I will ask, actually, I will ask my co-workers. Le voy a preguntar a mis compañeros. Whenever I don't know something, I am clear. I will ask. El día que yo no sé algo, yo soy claro y honesto. Le digo, yo no la conozco. I will find out. Pero la busco, okay? Yeah, because, I mean, yeah, I don't remember another one. Perhaps there's another one here in my mind, but it doesn't come to my mind right now. Seguramente por ahí anda otra manera, pero en este momento no la recuerdo. That happens, okay? But don't worry, I will ask, okay? I will find out for you. Yo se la busco. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Well, guys, oh, I was going to repeat one last time. Iba a repetir una última vez for you guys. It goes like this. Hey, Matthew. How is it going? Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody is here today. Because of the traffic. You know? You're right. Look. Who has the early and late shifts for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift. And Tom and Kate have the evening shift. Okay, let's see. Let me get you in first. You will have four minutes to practice. No, three minutes to practice, I'm sorry. Let's see. Just let me do something here. Perfect. Groups are created. Please jump in, guys. Three minutes to practice. Who has the early break for the coming week? According to the chef, chef Luke, it's get Mark, the Sophie, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kate the evening shift. Okay. Hey, Matthew. 
Pardon me, it's going. Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look, who has the, I, who has the early at late chief for the coming week weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift. And Tom and Kate have the evening shift. Okay. Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I believe that everybody is here, is here today because the traffic you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shift for the com for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, schedule Mark, or Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kate the evening shift. Okay. <laughs> Nuevo, otra vez. <laughs> okay. Repeat. Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I believe that everybody is here, is here today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look, who has this, who has the early, early and late shift for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift. In Antony Kate have the evening shift. Mark and Sophie, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kate have the evening shift. Okay, switch. Okay. Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody's here today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shift for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kate have the evening shift. Okay, switch again. Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know? You're right, Luke. Who has the early and late shift for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kay have the evening shift. Okay. Let's go back to the main room. Okay. Okay. Let's see who's going to be first. Uh, Elvia and Francisco. 
see, where are you? Where are you? Where are you guys? Oh, you, they are still in there. Oh, they're coming right now. That's great, that's great. So, Elvia and Francisco, you start. Okay, teacher, who will start? You, Francisco. Okay, teacher. Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shift for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Ma and Sophie had the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kay have the evening shift. Evening, evening. Evening. Yes, evening shift. Thank you very much, Shelby. Now, Daniel and Susanna. Susanna, you will start. Daniel. Hi. You start, please. Ah, okay. I believe Susanna. Uh, okay. Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I believe that everybody is here today because of the traffic you know. You're right. Look, who has the early, early and late shift for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kate have the evening shift. Perfect, very well done. Now, Amber and Fernando. Amber, you will start. Okay, give me one second, please. Okay, hey, Matthew, how is it going? Mm -hmm. Very good then. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of because of the traffic, you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shift for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kay have the evening shift. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Now, Wilfredo and Janira. Wilfredo, you will start. Okay. Hey, yeah. Very good, Wilfredo. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know? You're right. Look, who has the early and late shift for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kay have the evening shift. Okay, perfect, thank you. Claudia and Roxana. Roxana, you'll start. Okay. Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I believe that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know? You are right. Look, how was the air early and late tip for this coming today, for this coming weekend, sorry. According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift and Tom and Kay have the evening shift. Perfect, thank you very much. Jose Osorio and William Rosales. William, you start. Okay, hey Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know? All right, look who has the early and late chief for the coming weekend. According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift, and Tom and Kate have the evening shift. 
Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Francisco Jose and Walter Mauricio. Francisco, you will start. Okay, thank you. <coughs> hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I am relieved that everybody is here today. Is here today. Because of the chapter, you know? You are right. I look. Look, who has the early and late shift for this weekend? For this coming weekend? According to the schedule, uh, Mar Sophia had the morning afternoon shift, and Tony and Kay had the evening shift. Evening, Walter. Evening. And evening. Okay, okay perfect. Thanks to you. Now, Maria Alejandra and Marta Morales. Marta, you'll start. Okay, teacher. Hey, Matthew. How is it going? Very good, Ben. I'm relieved that everybody is here today because of the traffic you know. You're right. Look, who has the early and late shift for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift and Tom and Kay have the evening gift. Thank you very much. Now it's Maria Luisa and Silvia Avendaño. Maria Luisa, you'll start. Activate your microphone, Maria Luisa, please. Sorry. No problem. Hey, Matthew, how is it going? Very good, Ben. I believe that everybody is here today because of the traffic, you know. You are right. Look, who, who has the early and the chief for this coming weekend? According to the schedule, Mark and Sophie have the morning and afternoon shift. Then, and Tom and Kate have the evening shift. Okay, perfect. Sylvia, just remember that whenever we get the, the, the particle the before a vowel, you pronounce it like the, okay? The evening, okay? Okay, okay, thank you. You're welcome. Let's continue. Okay. Okay, guys, we are going to continue uh, working in something a little bit different, okay? Because of the manual. In page number 23 in your manual, let me show you. In page 23 in the manual, we got something very interesting, okay? Make it a little bit shorter. Okay. Look at the schedule at a restaurant, okay? This is the schedule of the restaurant. Look, they start working uh, around 10 a.m., okay? So there's the cashier for the first shift from 10 to 2 p.m., and then look, they close from three to four. And then you got Pamela is from 5 p.m. until closing time, until 10 p.m. We got the cook, we got the manager, we got the order taker, and we got the waiter. Okay, what are you going to do? Perfect. What we are going to do is to answer these questions. Read the schedule again and answer the questions below. Who is in charge of waiting tables in the morning shift? Who is in charge of managing the restaurant? Who is in charge of the kitchen in the morning shift? And who is in charge of taking orders during the morning shift? What does Matthew do? Okay. These five questions we are going to answer working as small groups. Okay. I'm going to divide you in small groups. So and I will give you six minutes for you to develop this exercise, okay? 
So groups are created. It's, remember, it's page number 24, 23 and 24, okay? Exercises three and four. Let's do them, guys. María Luisa, I sent you to a group. La mandé a un grupo. My connection is bad. Se va y se viene el internet. Está malo. Okay, I'll send you again. Okay. Of waiting tables in the morning, please. Uh, ash. Ash. I cannot <laughs> tell you. Please in charge of waiting tables in the morning, please. ¿Quién es el encargado de, de esperar en las mesas? No, no, no. Waiting tables. Okay. The waiter or the waitress. Oh, los meseros, entonces. Yes. Ok. En Walter. Homo en Matthew. Wait. Ajá. Matthew Homo en Matthew Tool. Yes. Who is in charge of. Manage, managing, managing the, rest the restaurant. Uh, Jennifer Rodriguez. Yes. The manager is Jennifer Rodriguez. Who is in charge of the kitchen in the morning shift? Uh, so Kevin, 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 Karen. Kevin, Karen. Yeah, Kevin, Karen, Julie. In the afternoon is Mateo and Linda, right? Yes. Or not? Yes. But the question say morning shift. Ah. Okay. The four question say who is in charge of taking order during the, the morning question shift? Question says says or ask yes. actually. <laughs> The question ask. Okay. Nosotros no the tenemos question, esa expresión. The question ask. La pregunta pregunta. Yeah, the situation <laughs> is that in Spanish, in Spanish it will sound weird, but in English yeah. it's okay. It's okay. The question ask. Asks. Asks. Yes, perfect. Okay. Thank you, teacher. The you. question for ask, who is in charge? of taking order during the morning shift.
I, I what does um, what? Linda Harris? Teacher, we have a question. Ask me. Uh, we need to resolve the part four. And yes, five, part four. four. Just four. Four. Ah, okay. Es que estamos Only. dando vía con las cinco. <laughs> what? Part no, five. Es que oh. We, we try to uh, solve the number five, but if you say that she's the number four. We are going to do it, but later, later. And I will explain to you before. La vamos a variar un poquito. Ah, okay. okay, thank you. We were trying to resolve in teacher. <laughs> That's always good. <laughs> Let's go yeah. back. See, let's see, we are waiting for everybody to come. They're coming in 20 seconds. Hello, I'm back. Okay, cool, cool. Great, Jose. Okay, let's Excuse see. me? No, nothing, nothing, never mind. No sé si me, sal, si me salí del grupo, teacher. No, it's okay, it's okay. Yo lo saco a todos después de un cierto tiempo. Okay, let's see. Okay. Who is in charge of waiting waiting tables? Ambar, tell me who's in charge of waiting tables in the morning shift. Okay, give me one second, please. Um, Karen and Kevin Dooling. I in the in the morning shift. Kevin and Karen Dooling. Okay, let's see. Waiting tables. Look, the wow. question says, "Who is in charge of waiting tables in the morning shift?" In charge of waiting tables in the morning shift. That means waiting tables, quiere decir the waiter and waitress. Okay. Uh, in this sorry. case, in the morning are Walter, Omo, and Matthew. So, okay. Okay, sorry. Now, thank you, Amber. No problem. No problem. Next question goes to, let's see, Marta. Is Marta here? Yeah. Yes, I am here. Who is in charge of managing the restaurant? Who's the manager? Uh, only Jennifer Rodriguez. Okay, there's just one manager, right? The manager yes. is Jennifer Rodriguez. Perfect. Now let's see. Who is in charge of the kitchen in the morning shift? That goes for Fernando. Who's in charge of the kitchen in the morning shift? Uh, okay, teacher, I hear you. I give you the schedule. Who is in charge of the kitchen in the morning shift? Kelly and Karen Dooley. Oh, okay. the Dooley brothers. Let's see, <laughs> in the kitchen, that means the cooks. Cuando decimos in the kitchen, estamos hablando de los cocineros. Kevin Dolly and Karen Dolly. Perfect. Now, let's see, guys. Next one. Next question says, 
who is in charge of taking orders during the morning shift. Okay. Let's see, that question goes to Roxana. Walter, oh, oh no, 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 perdón. Jorge Milano and Carlos Guardian are eh, ordered during order. Eh, are sorry. taking orders. Comienza de nuevo. No, no, comienza de nuevo. Jorge, George Milano and, and Carlos Guardian. Uh, taking orders during the morning shift. Okay, take orders, take orders during the morning Takes shift. Orders. Now let's see, what does Matthew do, Sylvia? Sylvia, hello. Hello, teacher. What does Matthew do? Um, Matthew is in charge of waiting tables in the morning shift. Okay, yes, Matthew is in charge of waiting tables in the morning shift. Perfect, excellent answer. Now guys, look, I need you as a homework to write questions to ask a classmate. How many questions? Just three, okay? As a homework, you are going to write three questions, just three, to ask a classmate related to what? Relacionadas con qué? Related to their job schedules, okay? Like, what time do you start working? Where do you work? Uh, who's your boss? Questions related, if you can adapt them particularly to their routines, that would be better, okay? And those questions are for tomorrow. Tomorrow you are going to do an activity where I'm going to pick some of you and you're going to ask those questions to each other, okay? Three questions. Bring them for tomorrow class. Esas tres preguntas se traerán mañana, okay? Any question? No teachers. Perfect. Remember, the idea is that you spend the most possible time speaking, okay? And during the rest of the class, we try to get new vocabulary, new words, but the idea is for you to spend it speaking. Now, let's see, I am been checking the platform. We are doing good. Some of you are still missing some little uh, details, but we are okay. Somebody send the... I guess this was the, the, the manual. Yes, the manual. Okay. Now, please, guys, try to be uh, on time of the class for the classes. I know this is the hardest moment for the classes because we are in the middle and some of you are like, man, this is tiring. But remember, now it's when the, the, better, the best part of the classes start coming because we are getting more into some more complex aspects. You are doing pretty well. And actually the last three classes, I, I've been avoiding using Spanish as much as possible. And most of you are like speaking, are like participating in the same. Almost all of you are using English all the time that you're here in the class. I will start pushing some of you to speak more because there are some that are speaking just a little bit, but don't worry. Remember, you can make as many mistakes as you want in this class. In my class, to make a mistake is not a big deal. I mean, we can solve it just like correcting it, and that's fine. Now, uh, tomorrow we got class. Remember, please, there's class tomorrow. And don't forget your homework, three questions related to daily schedules for any, for make them like in general, because you don't know who am I going to, to ask you to ask. Esas tres preguntas las quiero en general, porque yo voy a decir a quién le van a preguntar, okay? 
Like I can say, hey, Wilfredo, please ask Silvia, or Silvia, please ask Fernando, or Fernando, ask Susana. You don't know who am I going to, to get you with for the activity. So bring them. Now, before anything else happens, I'm taking some coffee. Let's get the attendance one last time. Ambar Elia Alfaro Gomez. Present teacher. Thank you. Carlos Antonio Morillo Hernandez, absent. Claudia Elizabeth Ramos Barrientos. Present. Thank you. Daniel Eduardo Segueda Valencia. Present teacher. Thank you, Daniel. Edward Ademir Noyola Brito. Elvia Janet Beltrán de Cabrera. Present. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. José Ernesto Osorio Morán. Present teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present teacher. María Luisa Morales de Corpeño. Marta Ana Belinda Morales de Portillo. Present teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Roxana Ibeta Asensio de Mejía. Present. Silvia Elizabeth Andaño Pineda. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Present, teacher. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present, teacher. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present, teacher. William Giovanni Rosales Galvez. Present teacher. Chanira Elizabeth Asensio García. Present teacher. Francisco José Menéndez Aguilar. Present teacher. Linda Marlene Acosta Barrera. Okay, we still got two minutes of classes. Where is Daniel? Where is Daniel? Where is Daniel? Yes, Maria Luis, I got you. You're at the Hi. So yeah. Sí, My internet is unstable. Don't worry, don't worry. Ya revisé sus mensajes. Okay, Daniel, where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Okay. Hi. Hey, Daniel, you are missing the activity we did at the beginning. So tell me about your a regular day for you, Daniel. Ah, okay. Uh, I wake up around at 5 a.m. a.m. and maybe sometimes I do a little exercise, but the most I don't. And around 7 a.m. I eat breakfast. Then also right now the office it at the same place that I live. So I, I don't have to move. But when we have a construction projects, I have to go to the different sites. And when the places, well, the first month of this year, we have projects in Acajutla. So we we went to well we went to live there with an uncle and maybe around eight a.m. eight p.m. is when we have to uh, the when we stop working and starting to relax watch. TV and, and other stuff. Okay, perfect. So interesting how you got your day design ordered. Well, guys, thank you very much. And I hope to see you tomorrow. Please be early if you can. Have a good night. Take care. Don't forget your homework. Okay. Bye bye. Have a good night. Good night. Bye. Have a good night for good everyone. Night. Good, night. Good, night. good night. Good night, everybody. Francisco, Francisco Eduardo.
please, please, Hello? please, 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 sure? let me see. Hello, okay, Francisco. Can you stay just for a couple of minutes? Yes, it's you. Jose, your no turn is tomorrow, don't forget. <clears throat> Okay. Actually, Francisco, uh, it wasn't your day today, but Wilfredo ran away. Wilfredo se nos corrió. <laughs> okay, but let's take advantage of this time. Tell me, Francisco, uh, is there any topic that you feel that uh, is not quite clear for you, perhaps? Algún tema que quizás no haya quedado del todo claro? Um, <clears throat> um, um, uh, usually, uh, uh, how do you say teacher? Well, el, el, lo I say in, in Spanish. Uh, no problem, cuando, no estoy en, cuando estoy en el, en el trabajo, a veces no, no puedo poner, digamos, como al 100% yeah, yeah. la atención. ¿verdad? Entonces, este, sin lo que trato la manera es de eh, cuando puedo cuando ya están subidas las, las clases a YouTube repasarlas oh you watch them again that's cool es eh, porque sí en el, en el trabajo eh, en, algunas veces se me dificulta digamos un poco poner del todo atención o sea, yo logro escuchar y entender pero yeah pero but la... you're not like a hundred percent in the class and yes, teacher, yes, eh, I, eh, oh, how do you say, no logro captar <laughs> Yeah, I understand it. Okay, mm -hmm. de los temas que hemos visto, ¿cuál siente que todavía, a pesar de ver el video, como que no del todo? Mm -hmm. eh, maybe eh, a specific topic, eh, eh, mm, Probably I, I I don't remember in this moment. Uh, I, or I, perhaps I, something where you would you would like some tips or something like that. Quizá algo en lo que quisiera un poco no sé algunas ideas, algún área en la que quisiera mejorar. In the in the great sentence. Okay, building up sentences. Mm -hmm. Yes, okay, sure. well, building up sentences. The problem is this, that they always tell us that we needed to, to follow a structure and to get the, the verb tenses. Todavía nos dijeron que agarramos los tiempos verbales que nos aprendiéramos la estructura, ¿verdad? Yes. Okay, and that's, that's actually, it's, it's very good. It's very important. Now, at, the, at this level that you are, what I will recommend you to do, en este nivel en el que ustedes están, lo que yo le recomendaría es keep on getting and acquiring vocabulary. Trate de, de seguir adquiriendo vocabulary. Because at this level, your problem is not that perhaps you don't remember the whole structure. Quizás su problema no es tanto que no recuerda las estructuras. Quizás su problema es a la hora de crear oraciones que no encuentra las palabras para transmitir la idea. Correct teacher, is 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 my problem. <laughs> and don't worry, don't worry, that's everybody's problem at this level. Ese es el problema de todo el mundo en este nivel. Don't worry. I mean, that's normal. Okay, what you need to do is this: acquire vocabulary. ¿Cómo adquirimos vocabulario? Vale, mire, vocabulario se adquiere porque usted puede conocer un par de tiempos verbales y darse a entender bastante bien. Pero si no tiene el vocabulario, que se aprenda las estructuras, usted va a estar like, uh, uh, how do I do it? Las dos cosas tienen que ir a la par. ¿Ok? Como por ejemplo, mm -hmm. esta semana hemos estado trabajando con el presente simple. ¿Se recuerda el presente simple? Mm -hmm. Ah, sí, sujeto, verbo, complemento. Para el mm -hmm. negativo usamos do y does, igual que para la pregunta, ¿verdad? Like, do you work? Do you study? Does she work here? ¿Ok? Eso es algo... Básico, básico. Lo vieron basic one and basic two. Que todavía lo vieron un poquito en basic three y lo volvemos a ver ahorita. Ok. ¿Qué es lo que necesitamos ahí? Entender que se usa el tiempo para transmitir este, hechos, hábitos, rutinas. Para eso utilizamos el presente simple. Ya tenemos dos cosas importantes. La estructura del tipo verbal, sujeto verbo complemento, 
para qué idea nos transmite ese tiempo verbal. Pero si no tenemos el vocabulario, como que no hay para dónde. Uh -huh. Porque el vocabulario lo adquirimos leyendo uh -huh. o escuchando. Son las maneras como nosotros vamos a ir adquiriendo vocabulario. Ahora bien, me dice usted, pero yo donde leo, este, no tengo la capacidad de leer en inglés, ¿verdad? Entonces, ¿qué hacemos? ¿Usted mira, dale? Eh, usually no, teacher. Eh, ¿Videos? Eh, usually, eh, yes, en YouTube. Ok, perfecto. YouTube tiene la opción, subtítulos, ¿verdad? Y nos yes. da la opción en qué idioma. Yes. Uh -huh. Entonces, ¿qué vamos a hacer nosotros? Meternos a los videos con los subtítulos en inglés. Uh -huh. Eso nos va a ayudar. ¿Por qué? Porque usted va a estar escuchando y se lo pone el audio en inglés, el subtítulo en inglés. Usted va a estar escuchando la pronunciación, viendo cómo se escribe. Yo le recomendaría uh -huh. que haga esto. Comience con videos que usted ya ha visto. Si es música, si es comedia, algo así, algo que ya ha visto traducido. Usted ya tiene la idea. ¿Okay? Luego, oírlo completamente en inglés y leerlo completamente en inglés. Why? ¿Por qué? De esa manera, usted ya tiene la idea general. Va a ir relacionando las palabras, lo que oye, con lo que ve. Y es más, podríamos dar un salto más. Escúchelo, véalo, y después de una o dos veces, trate de modular las palabras. ¿Qué es modular las palabras? Solo la mímica. No produzca sonido todavía. Uh -huh. Una o dos veces, modular. ¿Para qué? Para que esto, los músculos de acá, de la mandíbula, se acostumbren uh -huh. a formar. Recuérdese que es un idioma distinto. Hasta para uh -huh. respirar es distinto. Los sonidos son distintos. Si usted se sí. da cuenta, aún a algunas personas como yo, cuando comenzamos a hablar en otro idioma, Even our, the pitch of the voice changes. Aún el tono de la voz cambia un poquito. And that's normal because I am using a different language. I am breathing this differently. I am mouthing differently. Estoy respirando mm -hmm. distinto. Estoy poniendo mi boca en diferente posición. My mm -hmm. tongue, mi lengua se mueve distinto. It's different. It's just different. Mm -hmm. nuestra, nuestra mente tiene que acostumbrarse a que eso se vuelva natural. ¿Cómo? True repetition. Uh -huh. Al repetir. Igual que aprendemos a andar en bicicleta, al igual que aprendemos a conducir un auto, todo, todo lo que aprendemos lo hacemos a través de repetición. Uh -huh. Es lo mismo. Entonces, y después de un par de veces de estar solo mounting, comienza a producir sonido. Va a ver que es muy fácil. Ahora, las primeras veces que usted escuche y lea, va a entender poco. Normal. Uh -huh. Es normal. Don't worry. El peor error que podremos cometer en ese momento es agarrar el diccionario y comenzar a buscar palabra por palabra. <risa> Así no nos funciona. Nos va a ser lento. Nos va a ser más lento. ¿Qué vamos a hacer? Lea. Si hay una oración, comience a descartar. Esta palabra ya la he visto. Esta ya la he visto. Esta ya la he visto. Esta ya la he visto. No necesariamente quiere decir que en ese momento se acuerda qué significa la palabra, pero ya la ha visto. Si usted ya la vio una vez, ahí está guardada. Ahí está guardadita. En ese momento usted no se acuerda qué significa, pero ahí está guardadita. Vamos a buscar una o dos palabras claves que son las completamente desconocidas. Y puede ser que esas nos recuerden la idea principal. La idea. Y como acuérdese, uh -huh. lo que estamos tratando de entender es ideas. ¿Ok? Uh -huh. Y usted va a ir agarrando el vocabulario nuevo. Cuando haya encontrado una, dos o tres palabras nuevas, no busque 20 palabras, no haga el listado de las 80 palabras que no entendí, no, haga el listado de 3 o 4, hoy y esas 3 o 4 trate de ponerlas en una oración en oraciones relacionadas con algo que usted vea a su alrededor o que quizás vea en su trabajo trate de usar esas palabras en un contexto que es habitual para usted, ahí es cuando las memorizamos cuando nosotros traemos el vocabulario y lo metemos en nuestro mundo Uh -huh. Si nosotros hacemos oraciones, como por ejemplo, este, usted me dice, he plays, he picks up his golf balls, él recoge sus bolas de golf 
every day. Nosotros no practicamos golf. Y si relaciono el verbo pick up solamente con golf, se me va a olvidar porque es algo que no está en entrenamiento. Pero si usted lo relaciona, oh, the bus picks me up at 5 a.m. El bus me recoge a las 5 de la mañana. That's your everyday life. Ese es su día a día. Y es más fácil recordarlo. Porque uh -huh. lo puesto en nuestro contexto. ¿Ok? Porque lo, lo estoy utilizando ya en mi, en mi ¿cómo se llama? mundo. En, ajá, cabal, en, en mi rutina diaria, en mi, cabal, como en, su, en, en mi mundo. Yes, yes. Uh -huh. I mean, that's the idea. Uh -huh. Eso le puede ayudar. Practíquelo. Este, si tengo espacio uno de estos otros días, le vuelvo a avisar y me dice qué tal le va. Ok, teacher. Okay. Okay. No, okay. no, here to help you all the time. Thank you very thanks, much teacher. for staying. No, thanks, thanks to you. Have a good night. Rest. Thanks, teacher. You too. I see you. See you, teacher. <laughs>